So Continental Scientific Grilling, we actually, we're concerned with depths from the soil down to conditions relative to the mantle um, and topics that range from climate to geohazards. And so recent projects that we have completed were the Trans-Amazon drilling project um, that really focused on evolution of South America and biodiversity, um, on the NAMCOR drilling project that looked at a million years of sedimentary record in Tibet, um, ongoing projects that are really exciting, including to me is the Utah Forge project, which is basically trying to enhance our technology and research to maximize energy recovery from enhanced geothermal systems. Um, and some upcoming projects that are quite important based on changes in climate that we're experiencing now um, are looking at changes in the Ant West Antarctic ice sheet and how responsive it is to warming. That's called SWISE. It, forgive the acronyms, that's what we do for drilling projects. Um, and then a bedrock um, critical zone drilling project in California to look at how soils and bedrock influence both diversity in the soils and landscape evolution. We are a very broad interdisciplinary division. Um, we actually more focus on a technique and technology as opposed to a fundamental science question. So we are a tool to answer the questions. And, and we consider things um, from climate, energy, geohazards, structure and tectonics. And so all scientific drilling projects are interdisciplinary by nature. And interdisciplinary projects require people to get together and define and talk about the science questions. And one thing that's really great about meetings like GSA Connects is that we can get together, get in a room, whether it's coffee before the meeting, lunch, um, my division's having a town hall tonight um, where we can get together and talk about projects. Um, it's awesome in the fact that a lot of ideas come from these meetings where people sit down and talk and really define questions, maybe even approaches that they didn't think were possible. 